El Dia de Dela is here. The number one prospect in the game, according to some, is on the field. He is a Cincinnati Red, 21 years young. Ellie De La Cruz splashes into the show as the Reds take on the Los Angeles Dodgers. Yeah, not to get lost in all the hype of Ellie De La Cruz. Luke Weaver has been doing a nice job, and it's a ball and two strikes on bets. Weaver delivers, and it's a bouncing ball down the third base line. Fair knocked down by De La Cruz, but he couldn't glove it cleanly, and bets will reach on what will be ruled a base hit. That would have been a highlight reel play to begin his career. Instead, it's an infield hit for bets. Right down the line, and you're right. Ball will definitely find you. Freddie had a 20 game hitting streak going into the weekend against the Yankees but went just one for 14 against New York 3 0 pitch is low and outside for ball four so Freeman draws a four pitch walk on say a 2 0 3 but 18 home runs he is ripped on a line down the line into the corner Dodgers on the board just like that bets into score on a Max Muncy double and it's one nothing Dodgers and now one of the hottest hitters in this Dodger lineup the hottest hitter quite frankly in the Dodger lineup J.D. Martinez he lifts this one in the air to right field Freddie tagging at third making the catch is Jake Fraley he will throw to the plate here comes Freeman he will score standing it's two nothing Dodgers on a sacrifice fly for J.D. Martinez Max Muncy advancing to third on the play. They say J.D. Martinez the hottest of the bunch but David Peralta could make a case of his own the seven game hitting streak and Peralta loops it into center field that's down for a hit Muncy will score it's three to nothing in the top of the first David Peralta with his 20th run batted into the season it's kind of this race car of an offense kind of took a pit stop the last two games but the off day and here they get off the plane get into Cincinnati and you're right on the board it's Tony Gonsolin. One run over six innings on Tuesday against Washington despite not having his best stuff. Dave Roberts called it a gritty outing that drove his ERA to a National League best 177. Jake Fraley becomes the fourth different leadoff man for David Bell this season. Set to center. Fraley is on. Now Matt McClain will be the hitter. What's the game plan for these Reds hitters against a guy like Gonson? You look for a certain pitch that's elevated a little bit and you go to town. First pitch, smoke pass, third base in. Fraley shoots up to second, two aboard in a heartbeat. So the Reds have him at the corners, and now coming to the plate for the first time as a big leaguer. Here comes Ellie De La Cruz. A goosebump greeting. When he came on the field in pregame, fans were standing and cheering. Here's the payoff pitch to De La Cruz. McLean goes. De La Cruz walks. Bases loaded. A pitcher enjoying a Cy Young caliber season was particularly careful against De La Cruz in his first big league plate appearance. Yeah, as everybody will be. The Reds rookie depth is significant. It includes Spencer Steer. Tyler Stevenson, an excellent hitter, coming up with the bases still jammed. That young man, a 21 year old run, he, he touches home before everybody else touches. And now a second plate appearance for David Cruz. He worked a full count walk his first time. He also just about broke at Reds on Twitter. Smash to right center. First big league hit, and here he goes. Lightning speed. De La Cruz up to second. A stand up double. That was 112 off the bat. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> welcome to the show. This kid is electric. He hits a bomb, 112 off the bat. But you've got to follow him out of that box because this young man can absolutely fly. J.D. Martinez starts the fourth inning, 3 3 the score. And J.D. hammers one to left field. This ball is way back and gone. A home run. J.D. Martinez, his 15th of the year. Just dingers for J.D. 
And it's now 4-3 to three Los Angeles. His 10th home run in his last 15 games. 1-2-3 in the second, 1-2-3 in the third for Weaver, who looked like it settled into this game. But then the veterans that we're talking about get it going here in the fourth. Martinez a homer, Hayward and Rojas both single. And with the bets walk, Freddie Freeman's going to bat with the bases loaded. And David Bell has made the move. Alex Young to oppose Freddie Freeman. Bases full. Young fires 0 2. Freeman hits one way up there to deep right field. Fraley back, track wall. Goodbye! Grand slam on an 0 2 from Freddie Freeman. Man, he is special. Freddie Freeman breaks it open. 8 3 Dodgers. Hump back liner into left field for a base hit off the bat of Jonathan India. And it'll bring up Ellie De La Cruz for the third time tonight. He's been on both times. Here's the 3 1 pitch. Takes his walk. Spencer Steer has walked. He's also been hit by pitch. That came to the bases loaded. Boy, oh boy, Carlos Torres just keeps going out there. It's almost like all the pitchers in this game have trained him that that outside corner is wide. Steer. Left to left. Peralta on the track has it. India bluffs it second. Strong throw in. David Bell led home plate umpire Carlos Torres here at end. He's been thrown out. But I'm not sure, as fiery as the others were, if we saw this level of displayed emotion. Grounded at third. Back in. What could have been the end of the inning ends up plating a run with a throwing error from Max Muncy. It is eight to four. Base hit and advancement on the mistake, and the table set by Jake Fraley's aggression first to third. And there you go, the Reds getting an extra base. If India can reach here, De La Cruz would come to the plate representing the tying run in the sixth. Swing and there's a slow roller, third base side, tough play, no play. Everybody say Fraley will score. India reaches on an infield single, a little roller up along third, and the Reds are down three. On to third is Steer, but there's two down for Stuart Fairchild. Bounce to short, Steer breaks. Fairchild's hustle legs out an infield hit. Steer scores. Reds within two. Home the first time there was 4.33 seconds. Reds are only down by two. Need a base runner to be able to bring the tying run to the plate. And the Reds are big time in business in the ninth. And the bases are loaded. And the tying runs into scoring position. And here's Kurt Casale. He walked in a run! Bases loaded, one run game! A walk in the ninth, a walk in a run to a hitter hitting 172. Well, leaving him in there, lefty against lefty against Fraley. Hit it in! Jake Fraley hit by pitch! Oh, the wheel was wobbling and it has just fallen off the cart. Dave Roberts coming out to get Caleb Ferguson after Ferguson just had a miserable inning. Shelby Miller coming in to try to get us to extra innings. And Matt McClain, the Southern California native. The Reds may very well have a walk-off win here. 